double deuce. Uh, Penzoil. Penzoil. I'm gonna. I think. Uh, I think he can win. Yeah. Not only win it, he has a, a good shot as any. Being a former champion, he knows what he's got to do to get it done right now. Uh, I, I have to agree with you on that. I like Kurt Busch. I think he's aggressive where he has to be. Um, I don't know who out there has seen the race, but between him and Jimmy Johnson, if they could just stay off each other for a couple of laps during the race and stop fighting like big babies, I think both of them have a good chance. I think he should keep hitting Jimmy Johnson <laughs> to possibly just wreck him out, or, or Jimmy tries to wreck you out and wrecks himself out like a, like a dumb cat. Well, that's Dude. what's been going on this last race. They were on each other the whole yeah. race through, spinning each other out. It right. was a rough race. Right, right. Uh, who's this bum? <clears throat> What's this bum's name right here? Number six? Hey, how you doing? Jimmy Johnson. Boo! No, he's my driver. Uh, can he win it all? We don't have to say this answer is no. Um, <laughs> he's not going to win it all. There will not be a sixth time if there's a sixth if time Jimmy Johnson, that he sue is boycotting. Yeah, six in a row might lose NASCAR fans. NASCAR, I know you like to pump him up, but I'm just letting you know. It's not the Jimmy Johnson <clears throat> show. I know a lot of gentlemen. hardcores that stopped watching after he won last year in six. That's it. That's Way too it. Much. Because Kevin Harvick took him out. Yeah. This guy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Kevin Harvick a turd. <laughs> yeah, yes, he's a turd. In a box. All right, number five is who? Carl Edwards. Can Carl Edwards win it all? Yes. Why can he win it all? Fast car. It's a fast car. Becky Sue, what do you think? Absolutely. Love yeah. the numbers. Uh, 12 top, top, top five finishes, 17 top ten finishes. I mean, he's got the numbers. He's fantastic. I love watching Carl Edwards race. Kind of bummed that he decided to uh, stick around and not come over to Joe Gibbs Racing. I think that would have definitely been an asset to the team, but he's comfortable. Where he is, and I'd like to see him win a championship. It wouldn't happen to a nicer guy. I think he just needs a little bit of fire under him, and uh, absolutely, I think he could win it. He showed it at the beginning of the year that he had what it took, and that's all he's got to do is step it up again. All right, uh, there's another former champion here, Matt Kenseth. Matt Kenseth. Yeah. Right? Who's he drive for? 17. He's a 17 car. Yeah. It's because it's an alcohol car. That's what we. Matt Kenseth, uh, he absolutely uh, knows what it takes to win. Uh, I heard that. He uh, hung steady all year. You know, he's number four in the points. It uh, speaks for himself. I agree. Um, do I think that he has what it takes to win the championship? I think there are a lot more people that are in the chase that really have the push. You've got Carl Edwards. You've got even Ryan Newman that I think have a better chance at winning it than he does. It's got to be consistent, and there's not a whole lot of consistency with Matt Kenseth. Okay, okay. Number three is who? Jeff Gordon. Who's Jeff Gordon? Um, Jeff, he drives for the 24 Drive to Anaheim. Yeah? And is he good? Yeah. Never heard of him. I never Come heard on. Of him. Who does he drive for? I said Drive to Anaheim. No, who's his no, owner? His owner. Rick Hendrick. That's Rick right. Rick Hendrick. Beck, uh, we need to say Jeff Gordon, no, hottest absolutely. driver going in right now. I would love to see Jeff Gordon take it. I would love to see him take the championship. Yes. Might bring some fans back. There's a lot of Jeff Gordon fans uh, that would come back. Want to skip two? Okay, number two is a turd, so we're going to go to number one. <laughs> Who's number Kyle one? Kyle Busch. That's right, Kyle right. Busch. Number two was, what's his name? Kevin Hart. Okay, just to let you know, if you're not an NASCAR sure. fan, Kevin Harnick and Rowdy doesn't like him to bring you up to speed. 18, Joe Gibbs Racing, M&M's, and the 911, and the Double Mint. Yes. Rowdy Bush, number one in points. Can he win it all? Yes. Yes? Why can he win it all? He had a, he had a fast car at Bristol last year. He's got a fast car. At You've got to get to get away. He had a fast car at Bristol last year. That's right, Kyle Busch, uh, Becky Sulagano. Breaking records this year. Love watching him race. He's fantastic. He's one of the best out on the track. Not a lot of people like him, as you can hear from the distinct boos when they do driver introductions or when he wins. I love seeing him get out of the car and do that grand bow. I'm really hoping that he does win the championship. It'll be nice to get some new blood in there. Kyle Busch is my favorite driver. Um, I think he can win it all, and I think he's, he's going to show it by winning the first. Three races of the chase. Three races, I called it. So Who, what, are, what are the first three races? Do you know? I don't know the first three 
first. You don't know? Chicago. Chicago. Um, then I go blank and then it's Dover. Chicago blank Dover. Sounds good. Uh, we'll figure that out. <laughs> Maybe Jenny M could figure out what the race between Chicago and Dover is and flash it on the screen right here like the magical chick she is. Jenica Patrick. Jenica Patrick. Jenica Patrick. I like that. Cheers, Pony Broad. We call her Pony Broad on the rugby show. Oh, there we go. She's got a couple names there. Ah, oh, so that's your uh your uh your chase. Redneck racing special, Joey Redneck, who is torn ligament surgery, so he's out. Uh, he's hurting. He'll be back next week uh, with our Chicago wrap-up show and our preview for the race that Jenny M is flashing um, again right now. The preview is Kyle Busch. The preview is Kyle Busch. Cool. Anything else, Beck, you want to throw in there? No, that's about it, Matt. That's about I it. I got something. For the day. What do you got? Throw it into the camera. I right hope there. Kyle Busch wins. You hope Kyle Busch wins. Cool beans. All right, then uh, this has been a special edition of Redneck Racing coming up after the break. Simon Cow previewing some show called The X Factor. You're watching MaddieVision.com. Tell them, Rowdy. We dream big. We dream big. Yeah, baby.